Hi all, I catch up here. Thank you for joining me in exploring the Greater Liyue region last time. Before everyone here embarks on your upcoming journey to Inazuma, I'd like to take you around Liyue Harbor one more time. Today, we will visit various places within the harbor. First, ones with Chinese spelling names in the English version of the game, then other notable named locations. I will show you the Mandarin pronunciation as well as the meaning I think each location name bears. As you will see, many names are quite clever and fitting. Let's get going! First, there are the three general regions in Liyue Harbor. This is Feiyun Slope. Fo, A, Fei, Yun, Fei Yun. Feiyun means crimson cloud. This Fei is the same Fei as seen in Yan Fei's name, but different from the Fei in Feiyun Commerce Guild, which we'll get to later. This is Chihu Rock. Chi, He, Wu, Hu, Chihu. Chi is to eat, and Hu is tiger. It may or may not be alluding to a Chinese idiom. 扮猪吃老虎 meaning to fool then beat someone by first disguising to be extra inferior. 吃虎 also appears in other item names, such as 烤吃虎鱼 and 吃虎鱼刀 This is 玉京 Terrace. 玉鸡鹰京玉京玉京 means jade capital. Speaking to the fact that this place is usually where people of wealth and status in Liyue Harbor reside or meet up for essential businesses, this is premium real estate right here, and the landscaping and design definitely look high class. Next, let's check out all the named food and entertainment options in Liyue Harbor. First, a place run by Chef Mao and our lovely Xiang Ling, Wan Min Restaurant. Wu, an, wan, mo, yin, min, wan min. Wan min means ten thousand citizens. I can see it being a common restaurant name even in the real world today, as the name implies that the restaurant will see many many customers. Then we have the two rival restaurants, Liu Li Pavilion and Xinyue Kiosk. Le, yo, liu, le, yi, li, liu li. Liu li is colored glaze and has the same li as seen in Li Yue. Xi, yin, xin, yue, xin yue. Xin yue is new moon and has the same yue as seen in Li Yue. The two restaurants each takes a character from the name Li Yue, signaling their ongoing and equal competition. This is He Yu Tea House. He, E, He, Yu, He Yu. He Yu as a word describes someone with a gentle personality and a big heart. A potential upcoming playable character Yun Jin often graces the stage here, and she has many fans. This is Yan Shang Tea House. Yan, Shi, Ang, Shang. Yan Shang. Yan Shang here most likely means above the rocks. Note that Yan is also the word for geo in this game. There are many shops scattered around the streets in Liyue Harbor. Here is where you may find Bai Zhu and Qi Qi, Bu Bu Pharmacy, Bo Wu Bu, Bo Wu Bu, Bu Bu. Bu Bu means unpredictable, which is relatable when talking about a pharmacy, as it may be the place to visit following unforeseen circumstances. Next to the Adventurer's Guild is Han Feng's Ironmongers. He, An, Han, 
f o o n f o n g h a n f o n g h a n f o n g means cold blade, and often describes sharp weapons. It's a very fitting name for a blacksmith shop. This is one of Xingqiu's favorite places to be, Wanwen Bookstore. Wu An Wan Wu En Wen Wanwen Wanwen means ten thousand texts. A scene from the name Wanmin Restaurant a moment ago. Ten thousand is a popular quantity of choice to suggest. A copious amount. This is Mingxing Jewelry. Mo Ying Ming. Si Ying Xing. Mingxing. Mingxing literally translates to bright star. In today's world, this word also means celebrity. Next door is Si Gu Antique. Si Yi. C, G, U, G, U, C, G, U, C, G, U as one word means to admire forebears. Looking at the characters individually, we may also see it as rare antiques or to hope for antiques. Whichever the interpretation, it mentions a connection to history and the past. Lastly, Wan Yu Boutique. Wu An Wan Yi O Yu Wan Yu. If you have listened to your tour guide catch up carefully up to this point, you should know what Wan means by now. The more literal translation of Wan Yu is ten thousand existences. It's a very clever shop name because in this context it means to have everything. Implying that there are many things available for purchase here. There are a number of other places in Liyue Harbor that range from tourist hotspots to those not open to visitors to those you probably don't want to pay a visit to in the first place unless there's a strong reason to. Let's start with the last one, where Hu Tao and Zhong Li are affiliated with, Wang Sheng Funeral Parlor. Wu Ang. Wang, Shi, Ong, Sheng, Wang Sheng. The word Wang Sheng originates from Buddhism, and colloquially means to a new life. This is also my personal favorite Liyue Harbor location name. It's perfect for a place like this. Feiyun Commerce Guild is Xingqiu's family business, and we know it has a warehouse near Mount Tianhong. For a fei yun, fei yun, although pronounced exactly the same as fei yun from fei yun slope, the fei here means to fly, so the name overall means flying cloud. Yuehai Pavilion is where members of the Li Yue Qi Xing hold business meetings. Yue, he, ai, hai. Yue Hai, Yue is moon, and Hai is sea, so together this name is Moon Ocean. Very scenic and poetic. Meanwhile, I'd like to give an honorable mention to Gentry Mao Cai, whose residence is just across the plaza from Yue Hai Pavilion. It's no less than impressive for anyone to afford such a big mansion in Yu Jing Terrace. The name of this building, Baiju Guest House, isn't displayed in the game, but gets mentioned when you talk to Xiu Hua at the front door. Bo, Ai, Bai, Ji, Yu, Ju, Baiju. Baiju means beautiful white horse, which also represents intellectually and morally exceptional individuals. It may also be used in phrases to mean the quick passing of time, because in Chinese culture, beautiful white horses are fast runners. Yi Yan Temple. This is where the rite of descension takes place. Yi Yi Yan Yi Yan. A scene from the name Yan Shang Tea House. 
Yan means geo. N Yi means to lean on or rely on. Together, Yi Yan is an excellent name for a spot where people gather and worship the Geo Archon Rex Lapis, Yan Wang Di Jun. For completion, I'll quickly go through the Chinese names of Li Yue Harbor locations that have officially localized English names and probably officially localized names in other languages as well. The Chinese name of Jade Chamber is Qun Yu Ge, Many Jade Chamber. The Adventurer's Guild is Mao Xian Jia Xie Hui. Northland Bank is Bei Guo Yin Hang. Jade Mystery is Jie Cui Hang, Store of Jade Mystery Resolution. Scent of Spring is Chun Xiang Yao, Kiln of Spring Fragrance. Second Life is Rong Fa Shang Pu, Shop of Wealth and Prosperity. Ministry of Civil Affairs is Zong Wu Si, Department of General Affairs. Third round knockout is San Wan Bu Guo Gang. This is a pun referencing the phrase San Wan Bu Guo Gang, which comes from one of the four great classical novels of Chinese literature, Shui Hu Zhuan, Water Margin, or The Outlaws of the Marsh, depending on the translation. This phrase describes alcohol of concentration so high that whoever consumes three cups of it won't be able to walk away very far before passing out. Pearl Galley is Zhu Dian Fang. Zhu Dian is a type of pearl embedded head ornament for ladies in the past. The galley bears the same luxurious look as the accessory it takes its name from. The name of Beidou's ship. Is Si Zhao Xing, a character by character literal translation of Si Zhao Xing, is Star of the Premonition of Death. This is an epic name, and given Beidou's personality and that her name means Big Dipper, I wouldn't be surprised if she named the ship herself. Thank you all for watching. Feel free to like and leave a comment. Happy adventuring!